Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, this is Nash from Tesla Lagong. I just want to show you how to get our Apple TV Plus working Tesla. The first thing you have to do is to go into your web browser and then hit on tv.apple.com. You'll get Apple TV Plus content. Unfortunately, because the web browser is sort of floating window, you do not get a full screen working. But there is a workaround to get full screen working and it looks great on a Model 3 because of the orientation of the screen. The um, portrait orientation does not really work well, but then you do want the full screen to work. This is the workaround and it goes like this. Okay, the workaround goes like this. You first open the YouTube app. Wait for it to app completely and then go into sign in. In this case, I've already signed in. I'll just say manage my Google account. And then you want to go into the actual web search to get Plex to work. So I'm just going to put some gibberish in here because this will actually search the Google account. So some gibberish and it'll say, I can't find anything in the Google account. Why don't you just try the actual web search? In this case, the entire web is here available for you. When you go and delete that and hit on Plex, there you go. Now, since I've already opened Plex in the other web browser, I do see that it has been here. So I can go in there, um, log in here. So I can just go and, and uh, log in. So that is my login there. I can just say launch. Ta-da! Full screen, Plex. Isn't this cool? Same holds good. So if you want to go in and see Apple TV or Apple TV Plus content, all you have to do is go into your sign in, manage account, just put some gibberish there, and then click on Google Web Search. And here you can say tv.apple. then that will take you into apple tv plus you sign in and you got apple tv plus working in full screen this is tesla and the gong signing off peace